the Honda Civic Type R. There's few things that you need to know when or before you're getting one. The first thing is how to start the car. Usually when you get the automatic transmission, you press the brake pedal, then only you push the push start button. But for the manual, it's another thing. It's not the brakes, it's the clutch. Make sure it's in neutral. Then, press. So this is how you start a manual car. Next is the parking brake. They are using electronics. Disengage, press. To engage, pull. To disengage, you need to press the brake pedal. But to engage, just pull. You don't have to press the brake pedal. Next, the drive modes. There's four drive modes. Comfort, Sport, Plus R, and Additional individual you can customize okay let's start with this flip down you flip down it's comfort then you flip up it's sport it's gonna be a sports mode and this is plus r plus r is very similar to the sports mode which is uh i'll explain to you later okay now i just press the plus r and the display is going to change to the plus R which is a uh, difference than others okay how about the individual so you go up again now this is individual so you can set it here the individual setting so the first one engine response steering stiffness Mm, this is a suspension stiffness. This is the engine sound or exhaust sounds. I'm not sure, but this it will be louder in sports rather than the comfort. And this is the ref match. Ref match uh, the, is the one that engagement. See how sensitive it is. And this is the display. Uh, this display. So you can change it. They have a comfort, sport, or plus R. Okay, this is more aggressive. For this one, maybe I prefer comfort because uh, the spot, the steering feel, it will be very stiff. And the plus R is even stiffer. Suspension also is also whether it's uh, stiff, stiffer, or comfort. This, maybe I will choose comfort. Sound. Yes, plus R. I like a loud sound. Okay, because the exhaust, there's another waft. Whether to turn it on or turn it off. This spot. This one, I prefer to have plus R. I prefer to have plus R because the engagement, the gear engagement. So it's bigger rather than the end is over here. It's a bit too small. So I prefer to have, to have this display. Okay, now we are going to go through how to start the car by pressing the clutch. How to engage or disengage the parking brake. Yeah, you need to press the brake and the drive modes. Next is this. This one. Honda Sensing. For the Honda Sensing, yeah. When you press the button, you need to press this button, this will pop up. Okay? This one. This is the road departure mitigation. And this is the blind spot monitoring. And this is the low speed braking control. And this the CMPS. Collision Mitigation Braking System. For other brands, they call it pre-crash system. There's a radar at the front. So when you are in plus R mode, all this will be off. Okay? 
and then when you're in sports modes, then it can be on. But now I'm using individual. Because you might feel that very uh, you're not used to it because especially the lane departure. You feel that it's a bit too harsh to swell you to the left or right. Very uh, it's too sensitive. So you might want to turn it off. And the blind spot, sometimes it's too sensitive and too noisy, you can turn it off too. It depends, it depends. But for me, I'll turn off these two. And the other settings, all are in Japanese. Okay, in other settings, all are in Japanese. So, I will cover it in another video. And the entertainment like FM or Bluetooth audio is very straightforward. So, it's very straightforward. Apple CarPlay and Android Auto. So for this, you can check my video here. You can check my video here. I did one video before, so maybe you might be interested. Okay, so these are the few things that you need to know when you are getting or planning to get one. So the FL5 is better or the FK is better. You can check my video here to know the difference. Thank you.